Hello everyone and welcome, welcome to my intuitive energy um, videos uh, channel. So um, I wanted to look at this and this is um, about uh, Johnny Depp and this uh, lawyer, one of his lawyers called Camille. Okay, are they having some kind of affair? Let's have a look here. I've already shuffled these cards. I will shuffle them a little bit more. Are they having an affair? Um, because, you know, um, people's, when people work together closely and it's, um, you're helping somebody out and, and supporting them, um, you could actually, you know, but it, it would not be professional, in all honesty. It would not be professional to get involved with one of your clients. So, but are they are they have they crossed that boundary and are they <clears throat> having an affair so let's have a look here there's lots of speculation over the glances and you know and this touchy feely around them so are camille having an affair with is are they having an affair camille and johnny so the first card i get here is um yeah, I get here collapsing under the strain of this, collapsing under the strain of this court case and I'm trying to bring balance to this and trying to somehow bring balance to this. So whatever this is, this uh, connection that they have is trying to bring, bring balance also. It could mean that it's... Um, a support network for, for Johnny and uh, so let's have a look and I get here now I feel this is that this is the um, the lawyers that you know that they're, they're kind of really kind of working hard here for Johnny um, with this card here trying to recover losses too whatever that may mean trying to recover the losses um so that I, I get that that they're already thinking and I get the lawyers um energies coming through here because we're talking about uh, Camille I think she's they're already looking at trying to recoup the losses from this wow that doesn't sound too great but um I don't know this is what I'm getting here I get the princess of cups and I feel that uh, this is Camille the princess of cups who is uh, crowning this reading and I get she's she's a true kind of lady she's well respected in her profession um, and people do treat her very well and uh, respect her very well respected uh, lady mm. She, she also does things by the book. Um, she's worked on her career very hard. Uh, it's very focused on this court case, um, to be honest with you. She's very focused. I don't see any kind of love here so far, okay. I don't see any love or attraction between Johnny and this Camille. So far, she's very kind of focused on on this case but i feel at the back of her mind she's thinking we need to recoup some losses here i don't know what that means but that's it could be what johnny's lost okay i also get the devil card um i don't feel that johnny <sighs> would be her type is is too um i'm not saying that she she believes in in what amber is saying or anything like that i feel it's too much um oh i don't know i, th I think it's a bit too wild for her too wild for her so i get the devil card she sees him as a bit of a devil a bit of a devil and if if they did get together it would be illicit I also get this could be an illicit affair maybe it's past you know maybe there has been some kind of affection there from Johnny uh, maybe she has thought about you know uh, maybe she has thought about it 
because there is this illicitness here of this it sh should we do this or should we not do this um it could be okay i i get here that something may have happened between them <laughs> because i feel that i don't feel that johnny's uh i feel he's too much of a wild man to to get involved with a lawyer in all honesty um he, he's a creator he, he's you know he's a music man um i feel that she is his type uh, although he probably would entertain it for a while but i don't feel he would be fully invested in this um <clears throat> not just that he's just he's just coming out of um he's trying to sort out you know he's trying to sort out this this uh this uh court you know suing amber so uh, the last thing i feel maybe a bit of fun maybe a few drinks um i get somebody here is going to feel ashamed for what they've done they may have crossed the boundaries already okay wow i feel i'm, I'm actually getting here that that camille may have cut across this uh this professional boundary here already but i feel that johnny's backing off a little bit something happened here i'm not sure if they ended up kissing and and i don't know ended up in you know in in the bedroom um he's a very attractive man and um i i just get that people have picked up on this um behind the scenes energy with with this camille and johnny <laughs> Looking at this, um, it looks like she may have cro cro crossed her professional boundaries. And Johnny is kind of thinking, wow, you've crossed your professional boundaries here. You're supposed to be my lawyer. In fact, I can imagine him saying we can't get involved because, um, because of this. <laughs> wow. Uh, so get here. Yeah, it happened very fast. Um, uh, the Prince of, of Swords and the Prince of Swords is this would be a radical change in, in lifestyle for Johnny. So although he may be saying, no, I, I think, you know, we don't tell anyone about this. This is a secret. We don't tell friends and family, but this is his, his new family is, is this uh, team of lawyers and their friends and they do meet up for dinner and drinks so uh, they have become quite close this is what this is saying um it would be too much i feel this would be an absolute i feel this a uh, uh, a reluctance for johnny to to actually get involved with her yeah i don't yeah i feel she's crossed the boundary um showing her affection as well on the courtroom floor a little bit there eye contact he's realizing this and he's thinking he's backing he's backing off if this is yeah i don't want to get involved with my lawyer kind of thing i think we should cool this down i feel we should stop this or cool this down i don't want this drag being dragged out too late i think people have already noticed this and then this would go uh in favor of amber because amber's thinking yeah right johnny you even get involved with your lawyer kind of thing um that is just not ethical you know just shows your moral ethical standards and and you know that would actually go against him if this actually came out so he's saying no don't I get the Queen of Pentacles, which is, as we speak, is, is Amber Heard, is a Taurian, an Earth sign. Um, yeah, so she she's noticed that uh, that she is being questioned very intently, but by by this Camille, and and that she feels like she she felt that she felt this energy while she was being questioned, like she was. Uh, you know the um 
the new loved bombed kind of uh, the love bombed next kind of victim. That's the way that the Amber sees this. She sees this. She's thinking, yeah, right. I can see what's happening here, kind of thing. Um, I think it would be a big. It, it would have been a mistake because again, this will come out. Um, I also do get, I feel that she, she's already in a relationship, serious relationship with someone. So this is very secret. And I also get that um, it, it's, again, it's toxic. Again, toxic behaviour, risque behaviour, um, which would go uh, in favour with Amber if this, she's, you know, here we go again, you know, look at him uh, kind of thing. I don't feel this is, yeah, I feel this is uh, a shoulder to, to cry on, a shoulder to lean on is Camille. Afterwards, they all share dinner together. You know, Johnny is very generous and he would say, you know, I will pay for all of this. And um, I, 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 I wouldn't like to say there's been any kind of SEX here. But this doesn't look, this looks like they've crossed the line. She has crossed the line here. Elicit a fire with the devil card. So, and I get the queen of wands. So this could be Camille. Um, Camille is the queen of wands and she is next to Amber. She sees her as her opponent. So it's not just trying to win the case now it's now trying to prove that uh now trying to prove that um amber is is a horrible person and you know he's been wonderful to me because he's i get the love bombing part of this he's been absolutely adorable to me but i think like amber says he's like that for the first year or maybe it's not like that for the first year, you know, it's all allegations, okay. And I have to say, this is a card reading and this is for entertainment purposes only. And it's not fact, but, you know, this is a, you know, this is a card reading. So, yeah, um, over combative towards, and I feel that Amber has felt this energy so this feels like, a, you know, some woman attacking me rather than uh, a lawyer. I, any, anyway, so this is a new journey, a journey here. This is a journey. The two of wands. This is a new journey for this Camille. I don't think she's ever done this. I don't feel that she has ever cheated on her, her partner or ever crossed that professional boundary she's normally a very private person i think if this if this was to be revealed um you know she would be devastated because normally she's very private keeps herself to herself so let's do another layer on this are they because this is saying that that she has crossed the line and they have had some kind of illicit kind of um affair or some kind of that they shouldn't have had okay um i mean legally i don't think you're supposed to sleep with your lawyer okay uh, I get also Amber saying that's something that Johnny would do, you know, Johnny would, uh, you know, love bomb her. So she helps him. Um, she helps him win this case. Uh, I can feel that energy. That is, yeah, I can feel the conversation of Amber saying, you know, that's something that Johnny would do. Okay. Um, so let's have a look here. Um, are they having an affair? The Ten of Wands, the Ten of Wands, and the Ten, this is my new deck, so 
if you just bear with me, the Ten of Wands is in the, you know, upright position, so quite positive. Um, responsibilities, burden, feeling overloaded and oppression is the Ten of Wands. You know, it's that, it's like that burden card where they're carrying the wands, but this with this deck, it's like carrying the flowers overladen with burden with with flowers okay um the pressure of this lots of pressure even for camille it's too much pressure in fact she's yeah i feel she she's got involved with a client she shouldn't have got involved with And she has to not only deal with this high profile case, but she's now having to deal with, yeah, the Ten of Cups. Ten of Cups, there's no, um, you know, the Ten of Cups is in the right position, is marriage, love, um, and, uh, you know, and all, all the kind that, that goes with that, emotions. There's no, there's no emotions in this. There's no love. There's no, there's no kind of real connection here. There's no connection here. There's no connection here. So there's no love. But they, they cross the line here. Somebody, yeah, I feel she crossed the line with Johnny. And that's what this is saying here. Um, the King of Pentacles is Johnny Depp. Okay. Um, I get this card in reverse. I, I, this is saying that he, and I feel that, um, that you know, I, I feel that Amber feels this already. She, she kind of thinks, yeah, that, that is something that he would do, the King of Pentacles. Um, so I'm kind of quite shocked by this reading, actually, that anyone, but anyone would go to this length to try to, steer this in their favour um, um, and I'm just kind of reading the cards so it's like I said it's not fact and um, but the king of pentacles in 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 reverse and it's actually a female of feminine energy so actually yeah it could be Amber Heard actually or it could be Johnny one of the two. Um, so in reverse, it's a poor financial decision. Ineffective uh, role model, impulsive, impulsive, okay. Impulsive. Someone was impulsive here. I reckon this was like almost like um, a brief kind of fling that didn't mean anything, but I feel she's she would like to. I feel this Camille would like to actually be his partner and and you know sees it as you know moonbeams and fairy tales and falling in love. But how can you fall in love in the middle of? A court case like this against his ex-wife I mean how ridiculous would that be really and usually she's quite a sensible lady she's quite a sensible woman um, this is going against her character uh, impatience the temperance card impatience uh, lost um, you know let's get it over with let's get it out of the way so it doesn't interfere with the case kind of thing. Huh. Um, that kind of, like, let's just get this out of the way. It's it's kind of getting in the way, this lost. Um, not looking, the, these cards here are not even um, saying no, they didn't have an affair. Uh, they've not had uh, some kind of fling here. It, it seems like there was a lust between them, a, a closeness. Um, I feel that Johnny has kind of 
said backed off, cool, let's cool this down. We got that out of the way. Kind of rock and roll kind of rock and roll kind of energy of like, you know, like a wild man would say, let's just get that this out of the way and move on. So this this in in the reversed uh, imbalance um, being excessive. So this has brought this into a little bit of an imbalance. I feel that that Johnny knows this now. He's trying to cool it off. He's he's seen her. Although it's it's worked because she's got become very kind of attacking towards uh, uh, her opponent. A rival, in fact, and um, and I feel this is this 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 has worked uh, in 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 Johnny's favour. So yeah, so it's not straightforward. I feel that yeah, definitely that kind of starstruck. Wow, I've got a client who's Johnny Depp kind of thing, and she's you know kind of yeah cross the line here the queen of pentacles i would say the queen of pentacles definitely is amber heard she's recognized this she's she can see it she can see it she's like yeah i can see what's happening here and 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 this is quite childish uh the page of pentacles um again page of pentacles has got a lot to learn very immature now i feel amber heard thinking you know feels like she is evolved evolved from this because she she feels I'm, I'm just saying as it is she feels that she's she also was treated like this and she's above this and and she can see she sees it the show unfolding in front of her um I think she's actually playing this as well, as well as, you know, who would get involved with their lawyer and what lawyer would get involved with their client. It's all very, supposed to be all very shrouded in secrecy, but I think most of us have picked it up, you know, picked that up. Um, the three of cups. Um, yeah, her friends, her friends have, yeah, Amber's friends or sisters, the three ladies here, um, they can be right bitches too. The three, these three ladies, they can be right bitches. Um, this lawyer, Camille, is going to cross-examine these three bitches here and they're going to give it to her back because they're realising something's going on here. Um, so they're all going to try to crush each other in this situation uh the seven the seven of cups oh, gosh what a mess this is just going from one bad situation to to the next um wow uh the seven of cups delusional delusional wishful thinking distracted an overall fantasy wow wow um this is making me ill <laughs> just reading this the Seven of Swords. Surely Johnny would not go to do this, would he? Would he? I will do the, um, the pendulum. Oh my goodness! I, I just I, I had a request to do this actually, and I thought, oh, should I do this or not? But I did notice that little bit of a connection there between Johnny and this Camille. And I thought, okay, I will, because I felt the energies too. Um, 
not only that, I feel that Amber's picked it up, her friends have picked it up, they're realising, oh, right, is this what's happening here behind the scenes? You know, and these three women are hardened bitches, believe me. So they're not to mess with. These are Amber's allies here. Wow. <laughs> the Seven of Swords is deception, dishonesty, manipulation, getting away with it, getting away with it, secrets. Wow. Delusional uh, secrets. I'd say yes. They are having a little, a little bit of a tryst here, a little bit of an affair. Uh, I get, I get, I get that Johnny is saying, yeah, let's just get this over with and, and move on with this. And he's seen this as a tool to use against Amber, because if he's got this lawyer that's fallen in love with him, she's going to fight harder to win this case. Um, the Five of Pentacles. The Five of Pentacles in, in, in reverse. <sighs> wow. Um, crazy, crazy reading. Okay, recovery, vitality, stamina, strength and resilience. Whatever the outcome is to to this, um, whoever this is here, it's either Johnny and this Camille's kind of um, affair here that, that they're going to, or whatever this is, um, They are going to, they, they will get over this. It says that recovery, recover, recover from this, recover from this. They will recover from this. Johnny Depp will recover from this. Camille will recover from this. Camille will recover from this. That's what that card means there. Um, she's very strong. She's she's also made of iron she's a very strong woman and resilient so <clears throat> she's the type of person that would um but be strong enough uh to actually uh cope with this um and and, and actually cope with uh with johnny's wild wildness in a way and um but I also get, I, I feel he's thinking, oh, right, she's not really my type. I normally go for very creative types, either in music or, you know, actress or, or filmmakers or writers, very kind of uh, uh, creative people. I don't normally go for the people that that go by the law and go by the book and, and, and you know, and, and, and all that kind of thing. It's not my bag. So I get that. But she's very resilient. She's the one that would, she's the type of person that would fight for this man. Okay. It's all very shrouded in secrecy. It's all behind the scenes. But what this is saying is people's uh, kind of energies are picking up on this um, because they can't hide it. It's there. And also Amber has picked up on this. She sees this as, oh, here we go. This is Johnny's antics. And she can use this because she can say, yeah, you've been love bombed, so what, you know. And... Um, I do get, as, as I said, I get him backing off from this because he realises it's like if this came out, this may, would make him look quite bad. Um, so this is an Oracle deck. And we'll just finish off here. I mean, Amber can be a right bitch, a hardened or hardcore bitch. So are these three friends of hers. 
And then we've got this lawyer who is quite tough and resilient and she can cope with this. Yeah, something's happened between, uh, I think we're, we're answering, answering the question here, um, seduction, seduction, okay. There was something that happened here. Let's get this out of the way. Uh, lost seduction and uh, it's kind of over now. Um, I don't feel this lawyer thinks this is over though. She's still wanting um, the gardener. Yeah, the gardener is pretty much quite quite ruthless in, in thinking, okay, we need to get this done. This happened. Let's just put this to one side and, and let's let's get along. Let's put this to one side and let's get along with what you know what needs to be done to win this case. So somebody has got I think I think he's got his um, people have noticed the observer the observer people are noticing and I don't feel Johnny likes that Johnny does not like um, because you know the observer people are watching people are speculating what's 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 going on here oh wouldn't it be nice if those two got together but it's in reverse so um, it's not to Johnny's favor if people are noticing that that there's something going on and i think that that he is so worried about this he's so worried that this has been picked up on um but i feel that he felt quite happy in her company and he feels quite happy having dinner with her cooking with her whatever they do together this lawyer if it because i get oh on a sunny day but i get here also oh on a sunny day with this card um if it was in another lifetime we could do this but we can't do this right now oh on a sunny day if only we could but we can't looking at the pendulum let's have a look here did johnny and this camille have a uh, an affair a love affair yes or no yes they did Is this love affair still ongoing? Is this love affair still ongoing? It is. It's full on. But is, is Johnny kind of trying to keep this a secret? Oh, that's yes. Massive. Massive yes. He wants to keep this very secret. Very private. Oh, look at that. Uh, is he worried that this will actually come out and ruin it? Yeah, oh, look at that. He's really, really 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 paranoid and paranoid look at that wow i've never seen a big yes in the whole of my reading tarot <laughs> okay that's huge that is absolutely dumbfoundedly huge i'm gonna leave it there guys um that's my take on that I may do a follow-up on this. This looks like it's ongoing. But Johnny doesn't like it. He's trying to cool it off. It would be interesting to see this lawyer questioning these hardcore bitches here. Because they're all in they all know now. They're thinking, yeah, right, Johnny, you're you're having, you know, you've started an affair with your damn lawyer, you know, and it's you know this is a card reading it's not facts and <laughs> believe it or you don't believe it okay i think she's even got a partner so it is an illicit affair nobody knows about this but we do thank you for watching please subscribe like share and bye for now bye bye